Okay, it's beer o'clock on Real Old Craft Beer today. We've got a beer from Duval and it is a bottle of the Triple Hop coming in at 9.5% ABV. 330 bottle, 2015 date on this one. There's the bottle cap. Let's get the beer out into a glass and see what we get. And believe it or not, Right after that smoky opening, I'm going to tell you that this is my first Duval, original Duval on the show. I know we've been reviewing beer here for four years now. Can you believe it? Four years! But, I just, it's just one of them beers I've just not got round to reviewing. I see it there in the supermarket, and for some reason or other, I just pass it. I believe Duval, now put your comments in the comments box on this, I believe Duval own Brewery Oma Gang, maybe, I think. It's it's part of their kind of American franchise of of uh, the, the brewery out there in America. And so I, I've re reviewed most of Oma Gang's beers, so you could say that I have drunk some Duval beers. But actually with the kind of big red Duval label across the front, um, dating back from 1871. No, I've not reviewed any. It's a clear glass of beer with a two-finger white head. Lovely, lovely carbonation rushing from the bottom of the glass. The clarity is great. It's a lovely golden colour. I'm going to add the, the yeast at this stage if there is any in there. Because these beers, these Belgian beers, generally the yeast is meant to be added to the beer. It's your own preference. If you don't want to do it, it's up to you. But I always kind of try and add my yeast in with German and Belgian beers. I'm going to get my aroma, or I'm going to get the aroma on the beer. And for me, that's a very kind of lemon grassy, lemon and then grassy aroma. It smells a little bit like freshly cut grass. And, and the gardener who's just cut the grass has been running around with a lemon, squeezing lemon all over the gra all over the lawn. It's that, it's that kind of aroma. Lovely and hoppy with that, again, that kind of Belgium yeasty, spicy aroma there in the background. Mmm, lovely and lemony. I'm going to dive in. Cheers. Wow. Wow. Stone the Crows. Stone the Crows. That is a really, really hoppy beer. To the point where you want to scratch the back of your eyes. It's that hoppy. But somewhere along the line with this beer, it's kind of lurking underneath. It kind of, it's, it's, it's estuary. It's that Belgium yeasty estuary, lovely, spicy banana, slightly earthy taste. But the main part about this beer, it is a big part about this beer, is one, the drinkability. It's a lovely drinkable beer, even at 9.5% ABV. And number two is the hops. The hops are just absolutely mesmerizing. It's a 2013. So it's 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 fresh hop. And you can tell it's been there. Uh, ah and I wish I never read it because I was just about to take a big blind jump at Sriracha Ace. It's that dry, spicy, lemony taste. And it's just got written here, look. Dry hopped with Sriracha Ace. Okay. It's good. Let's carry on tasting.
carbonation on this beer. It rushes to the to the top of your mouth. It rolls on the back of your tongue. It kind of pushes around the inside of the mouth. It really does push that that hoppy flavour around. And after the first taste, after that big first stone the crows reaction, um, I gave that reaction because it was an explosion of hops. And perhaps for all the time I've been reviewing beer, perhaps I've been wrong to give Duval a miss. Tell me, again, sorry I'm asking you to comment all the time, but please comment. Is Duval, when you see Duval in the supermarket, you think, ah oh, right Duval, I'm going to pick some of that up. Or are you like me, you, you kind of see it there, pardon me, and you think, ah do you know, I'm going to give that a miss. Don't ask me why I've kind of given it a miss. I did see this in my local bottle shop in Cardiff. And I seen the triple hop. And I thought, whoa, do you know what? 9.5% ABV. Them lovely kind of Belgium estuary kind of taste will probably work really well with the hop. So that's the reason why I picked it up. It had that big hop flower across the front. It was green, it was exciting. Perhaps that, what, that that's the reason why I kind of dodged Duval for all this time. But what one final thought and a tasting then before I rate it. And that is that this beer is hopped to the to the gills. They must have added so many hops to the kind of kettle that it really does explode on the tongue. It's lemony, it's it's limey. It's grapefruity, it's dry, it's it's just so good, it's just so good. And then the wheat, then the kind of banana-y, spicy, Belgium yeast, it all combines to produce a really good beer. I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10 from Real Ale Craft Beer. I think that kind of, it's a fair rating. It's a very, very good beer. It's more than solid. Yeah, I'm going to leave it there. 8 out of 10. Go and check out Duval Triple Hop then. 9.5% ABV. Really good beer. Put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer reviews and cheers.